Scott Z. Burns' The Report, which exposes America's shocking treatment of post-9-11 terror suspects, attracted a powerhouse ensemble to its key roles. Whether a part was large or brief, performers were eager to lend their talents to a story so important to our nation and one so urgently relevant for today. I'm Dave Carger. This is Variety Cinema Essentials. CIA did their own investigation into the death of Ghoul Rockman. The officer in charge was recommended for a performance bonus. They promoted him. He's still out there in the field. Well, are you accusing the CIA of murder, Dan? Because that sounds like where this is going. Two pieces of casting were particularly critical to this suspenseful, true narrative. Adam Driver top lines as Daniel Jones, the real life but little known chief investigator who brought the truth about torture claims to light. And Annette Benning was the ideal choice to play California Senator Dianne Feinstein, who set the wheels in motion out of the conviction that it's fundamentally wrong to cover up the misdeeds of government officials. So, did they get anything actionable from him at all? Anything that saved lives? They waterboarded him 183 times and then concluded KSM may never be forthcoming or honest. Everything they got from him was either a lie or something they already had. Well, okay, so my first question is, if it works, why do you need to do it 183 times? Maybe when the report comes out, people will finally see that. These are people who go to work and are in fact supposed to sort of be quiet and silent and not seen instead of going, gee, I'm gonna choose a career path and save myself. You're willing to risk your career um, because you found out a truth that needs to be told. In support of Driver and Benning is an extraordinary host of distinguished actors whose performances capture the urgency and moral complexities of this true story. The Affair's Maura Tierney plays a CIA executive who defends, then doubts, the torture policies. Michael C. Hall is a CIA boss who never doubts. Monk's Ted Levine plays controversial intelligence director John Brennan. Tim Blake Nelson of Watchmen is a whistleblower who stays in the shadows. Matthew Reese of The Americans portrays a reporter who helped break the story. And Mad Men's John Hamm appears as Obama's chief of staff who needs to manage the report's optics during a crucial campaign. What I really wanted to do was give the audience every opportunity to come as close to these characters as possible and see what they were dealing with and see the struggles they were having to overcome to get the truth out. The guy planned 9-11. We will not allow this to be covered the up. The intent is to gain intel, save American lives. History is written by the victor. We need to change our approach. How is that even ethical? Nothing could be further from the truth. Democracy is messy. The report joins the ranks of important political masterpieces, and much credit is due to its enormously talented ensemble. They rose to the occasion with indelible performances in a must-see film about American heroism.